Hi, this is Andy with Diesel Specialties in Sioux City, Iowa. Today we're going to talk about a little bit more of a specific application as it, as it applies to the Cummins 8.3 engine with the Nippon Denso EP9 pump on it. They're timed just slightly differently than maybe what you're used to on the Bosch pumps. The Bosch pumps are always timed back here on the Governor. The Denso pumps are kind of more in the middle of the pump and it's timed actually on the pump camshaft. So again, we're going to start with our engine timing pin, which is going to help us find TDC. Remember these pins are plastic, don't put any excessive torque on them. That means you have to pop that front gear loose before you put this pin in. Once you have your engine rolled around on TDC and you have your engine timing pin engaged, what we're going to do then is we're going to take this big cap off the center. And what we're going to find under there is our pump timing pin. Again, plastic pin don't put any excessive torque on it. Right now, the spring is on this side of the pin, which holds it in the run position. What we're gonna do for timing purposes is, we're gonna probably first look in this hole and see if we can see the slot in the camshaft, and then that's what we're going to engage this pin in. So as we slide this in here, that's gonna engage, our spring is gonna go on this side of the pin this time, and then we're also going to put the cap back on to hold that pin engaged for when we take this pump off. But I'm, I'm going to leave that off just so that you can kind of see that timing scenario the way it is. Once we have the pump off, then what we're going to do in reverse order when we put this pump back on the engine is it'll come to you with this pin engaged just like this, or it should. If it, if it doesn't, you've got to find that before you put it on the engine. We've got the pump setting back on the engine. We're going to do our pre-torque on the front gear, which you can find in any Cummins manual, or it's also a, a torque spec that we'd be more than happy to give you. Once we have the pre-torque, we're going to remove both pins. We're going to slide this pin back. We're going to take this pin out. We're going to put the spring on the run side so that it does not engage any further. We're going to put that pin back in. We're going to put our cap back on. And again, you've got your engine timing pin pulled back out. Then you're going to do your final torque on that front gear, and you're ready to go. Again, you can always roll it around and do a double check to make sure all your pins still fall in like they should, and you're done. This is Andy at Diesel Specialties, Sioux City, Iowa, where we know your diesel.